Nothing more fun, more fun than anyone. Billy here with RetireEarlyLifestyle.com. We're walking through the streets of Lecce, Italy. Lecce's got some very interesting architecture. And we're on our way, hopefully, to an amphitheater, a Roman amphitheater. So that's our destination for this morning. It's been an interesting trip. We've been in Italy now for a little over three weeks. And a tip, well, it's not a tip. It's, I mean, we're seasoned travelers, you know. Casey and I have been traveling for decades, and we were in Europe last 1979. But, but you know, it's hard to remember that what happened back then. But um, I don't think we had reservations or anything. I mean, the internet wasn't around, and and Booking.com wasn't around, and so I mean, we just pretty much showed up. Well, I don't think you can do that anymore. We're finding a lot of places booked out, so we have to book, in a, book out ahead. Um, but what we're finding is the biggest hurdle and hassle is the is rooms. Um, you know, we came here for a week. We booked for seven nights. What is your name? And um, it's you know a B and B now to us. We've stayed in some very nice B&Bs in Napa Valley, California, where the breakfast spreads with, are just fabulous. Well, here, breakfast is not included. We've got a B&B &B with no B. So, well, we've got something going on here. This is church. Anyway, um, you know that that's just one of the um, hiccups that we've had so far. It's just, it's just we're, what we're finding is, or what a suggestion might be for Booking.com, and that would be. It'd be nice to see the layout of the room if they could, book, if they would have a floor plan of a place. And I think that would make things much easier because we've we've um, rented a place and it was pretty small, and that's certainly not the way the photos depicted it. But anyway, 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 we're enjoying ourselves here. Um, Lecce is an interesting place. It's a little younger than than other places we've been, which is refreshing. So we seem to fit right in. There is a university here. Met some kids, some young men yesterday who are in university. Many little cafes, which is where we're gonna be going here real short, shortly. This is a new area for us, so we, every day we kind of explore another another quarter of this place. Okay, I'll pick this up once we get down here to the amphitheater, assuming we find it, which I think we will. Another day in the life of Bill and Acacia from Retire early lifestyle. Dot com.
Buonasera. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Buonasera. Okay, we found it. Let's go have a look. I guess we can't get down into it. Looks like they're doing some restoration work here. This is a Roman amphitheater in Lecce, Lecce, Italia. I can't really see what's I'm going to go over to that end and see what I can find. I moved as far as I can go without getting into the construction area, which is off limits. Anyway, this is, um, this is what we're seeing. This is right in the historic area of Lecce, so it's very easily walkable. From our room, anyway. Or our B&B &B without the B. Imagine what went on in these places. I don't. Sometimes I don't like to think about it. Another day in the life, of Billy Nicasia, from RetireEarlyLifestyle.com. Billy here with RetireEarlyLifestyle.com. We're running around Lecce, Lecce, Italy. This is beautiful plaza. I hope you can hear the music in the background. There's a Roman amphitheater over there uh, behind that construction plywood. I guess they're uh, renovating it. No. No brush. No Kyo brushes. We, sat, we just came to a little cafe and um, ordered a coffee and a couple of croissants. It's supposed to be it was filled with apricot jam. Okay, bon appetito. Another day in the life, Billy Nicasia from RetireEarlyLifestyle.com. Nineteen ninety-one, the critics said it couldn't be done. I wanted to retire, but they were still very young. Selling everything, now they have a life in the sun. Having more fun, more fun than anyone. Traveling the world to faraway places. Eating strange food, putting in their paces. Hanging out in Mexico, making lots of friends. It's a lifestyle, they live it to the beautiful land. You see, it didn't take long, living the dream. It's easier now than it ever seemed, it didn't take long. Let them show you how. So that you too can retire now.
That was four decades ago. 